Dogs are a source of comfort and part of the family, as we all know. When Sparky slipped past an unlocked fence and went missing for nearly a year, you can imagine how its owner felt. Oh, terrified, I'm sure. News Channel 5's Ryan Hughes explains how Sparky was finally brought back home. I've got some pictures. I took photo albums of him through the years. Flipping through an old scrapbook. Always near her. You can Sleeping see Sparky here. is in almost every picture. He's a small dog with a big personality. And he's been by Lisa Rarlson's side for the past 16 years. My husband passed away 11 years ago. He was, you know, was with us through all that. So he's been a big part of our family. He's gone on family vacations, Georgia, North Carolina. But last year, a piece of Lisa went missing. Before we noticed it, he was gone. Last October, Lisa was living in a cottage in West Palm Beach. She says it was a rainy day and she accidentally left the gate open. That is when Sparky snuck out without anybody realizing it. We looked for a week or two just straight looking for him. Lisa and her daughter made missing flyers. They offered a reward, but Sparky was 15 at the time, partially deaf, and hope faded after a few weeks. We pretty much figured he passed away and it was sad because he was part of us and we didn't stop. We talked about him every day. But after 331 days, nearly a year later, Lisa saw a post on Facebook last week from Sunshine State Westie Rescue. I didn't even start scrolling. It was a picture of a dog that looked like Sparky. We're told Sparky was picked up as a stray and the rescue pulled him out of the shelter before being euthanized. His hair matted and dirty, but this face spoke to Lisa. And after nearly 11 months, they were finally reunited. I feel, I feel like a void in my heart was filled. I really do. Never thought I'd see him again, but here he is. <laughs> I wish he could talk. <laughs> Come on. In West Palm Beach, Ryan Hughes, WPTV News Channel 5.